from amazing movement mods in Minecraft 1.18 that will blow your mind, to amazing parkour maps, and even a few interesting inventions along the way. I am the Derpy Bell, and this is your daily dose of Minecraft. If you enjoy the series and want to see more, consider leaving a like, comment and subscribing to this channel. It helps us a lot and it keeps the series going. Thank you. A player by the name of Tyler Martinos is showing us some clever placement of Crying Obsidian, giving his enchantment setup a really nice aesthetic touch. As you can see, the Crying Obsidian particles actually fall through trapdoors. Imagine having this entrance in your base. You'd constantly just find yourself opening and closing the door for no reason, just to look at it. This is how you kill a ghast with melee. It has a 95% death rate though, so don't come blaming me if you fail and fall into lava. The game tried to spawn this player in as a skeleton horseman. Train Guy 9512 has created this Minecraft 1.18 fabric mod that actually overhauls entity animations. The animations are so clean, and whilst on the subject of 1.18, I'm actually in the process of beta testing a 1.18 server for you guys to play. It's survival, and if you're interested in joining, the IP's on screen and in the description. It's a Java Edition 1.18 server, but Bedrock players can actually join it using the same IP but port 25565. Keep in mind it is just a beta test, but I'd love to see you on. Little Failure has created Hogwarts with a Christmas theme. He's also provided you guys with a download link, so if you're interested, check out his link down below in the description. As with every video we feature. This is the first house Bert We The 35 has built in Bedrock Edition. And I think he messed up somewhere, I just can't put my finger on it. Have you ever seen a turtle egg where you can actually see the baby turtle moving inside? Well, now you have. Tarty's Orange is showing off his parkour and elytra skills with this one. And it's pretty impressive. Infinity Sword turned the sky into a solar system. I can't stop watching this dancing terrain, it's just so mesmerizing. Why does the terrain have better dance moves than me? In case you didn't know, in Minecraft 1.18, there's this bug that basically makes zombies refuse to jump over azalea bushes. And yes, it works for baby zombies too. So if I were you, I'd invest heavily into these bushes, at least until they're patched. Gabbit Craft has spent four months creating the Spiral Caves parkour, and here's their trailer. 
Sleeping Brins has made a 1.18 iron farm, but it's not your ordinary iron farm, because it doubles as a helicopter. People have started to notice that the new 1.18 generation actually doubles as an elytra course with all these massive mountains and huge open caves. All you need to do is put a few rings and just like that, have yourself a perfect elytra course that has just the most amazing view. Let me know in the comments what kind of things you've built so far in the 1.18 update. So far my base isn't too much, I've just been exploring the new caves and man they're awesome. But I'm interested to see what you guys have done so far. So let me know in the comments, I'll be reading them all. Foxfighter9000 is working on the Infinity Gauntlet data pack for Minecraft 1.18. And this is the progress he has so far. I, I don't think I can handle that amount of power. One thing's for sure, this player won't be doing another Bastion anytime soon. That boy was piglin trading, then all of a sudden, death. This player made his very own plane bomber. Imagine the devastation if he just flew over your base. And if you're this far into the video and you haven't left a like or comment, I might have to convince this guy to fly over your wheat farms. Don't tempt me, because I think I have his number actually. Bin Bing is showing off his data pack that adds artillery strikes into the game of Minecraft. But those poor villagers, man, what, what do they do to deserve that? More builds made a Christmas themed build in Minecraft using command blocks. And it looks stunning, he did an amazing job on it. And I'm getting super cozy vibes just watching this. More builds back again, this time he started off making a Minecraft parkour map based on Celeste. The blue stuff kills you, similar to the original game. Significant Ear has made his automatic cake maker, and I regret watching it because it just made me super hungry and wanting cake, and I have none. So I'm going to need you guys to suffer just like I have. Enjoy. It is difficult with showing off where his survival build is right now. He said it's not finished, but man, if this isn't finished, this just puts my builds to shame. Even my complete ones don't look anywhere as good as this. Tropical fish and glow squids in the new cave generation are just a bit broken. I don't know if you noticed this, but I have on the server I mentioned earlier, things just spawn and then just die. Oh, this is, oh, I'm going to horribly pronounce this person's name. Bethmoth Nimoth. <laughs> that was just awful. That's his old base on his old server, but he decided to search on for a new mountain to call home. Which is a shame because that is just a really nice looking base.
Wow, you made it this far into the video, so you must have enjoyed it, right? Please consider leaving a like and comment, and consider joining my server IP in the description. We're currently beta testing it, but I think it should be good. I've got two more videos on screen I think you will enjoy. Thank you.